Greetings in the matchless name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. You are listening to the series Crucified Love 40 Redemption Stories. Today we are going to see the testimonial of Saint Lucy of Syracuse, a radiant witness of faith and courage in persecution. Saint Lucy of Syracuse, a revered figure in Christian history, shines brightly as a beacon of faith, courage, and unwavering devotion to Christ amidst persecution and martyrdom. Her life serves as a powerful testament to the transformative power of faith and the enduring strength of those who trust in the Lord wholeheartedly. Lucy lived during the 3rd century AD in Syracuse, Sicily, during a time of severe persecution against Christians under the Roman Empire. Despite the risks involved, Lucy fearlessly proclaimed her allegiance to Christ and remained steadfast in her faith, even in the face of intense opposition and hostility. One of the most well-known aspects of the Lucy story is her commitment to her war of chastity and her refusal to marry a pagan suitor. This decision angered the pagan authorities who sought to compel Lucy to abandon her Christian beliefs and submit to their demands. Despite the threats and coercion from the Roman authorities, Lucy remained resolute choosing to endure persecution and martyrdom rather than renounce her faith. As for history, she was subjected to various forms of torture and abuse, yet she endured it all with unwavering faith and courage, trusting in the strength and providence of the Lord. She was then fatally stabbed in the neck to death. Psalms 27 1 says, The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? Even in the amidst of her suffering, Lucy radiated the light of Christ, bringing hope and comfort to those around her. Her steadfast devotion to Christ and her willingness to endure persecution for his sake ultimately led her to martyrdom. Lucy's life challenges us to examine our own commitment to Christ and the depth of our faith. Are we willing to stand firm in our faith even when faced with opposition or persecution? Do we trust in God's strength and sovereignty? to carry us through every trial and tribulation? Like Lucy, may we shine brightly as lights in the darkness, reflecting the love and grace of Christ to a world in need of hope and healing. May her example inspire us to remain steadfast in our devotion to Christ, even in the face of adversity, and to trust in His power to sustain us through every trial. Amen. God bless you.